hey guys welcome to the channel sorry about that intro my channel is basically switched to a automotive themed channel now because this is 2021 i'd like to do another 90 gallon reef tank update that i rarely do i only do it on a few occasions let's go check out what we have here or what i have well personally my black percula clownfish or black mocha percula clownfish are hosting this bubble tip anemone. Now someone can you please tell me why this anemone never bubbles up. It's more of a long tentacle anemone. I have not seen it ever do a bubble. So this could be a long tentacle anemone. I'm not sure. Uh, but they've been living like that. It's been healthy. I mean, they've been eating whatever I throw in the tank, whatever gets stuck in his tentacles. And occasionally I feed it a uh, a silver side but it's kind of hard to feed a silver side with this guy this guy right here this nice your trigger fish because uh he likes to eat silver sides well and it'll steal right from that enemy um and also yeah this is my amphilia that been growing like crazy i got it running all the way here there's some growing in the glass here my kenya tree corals are growing great this green hairy mushroom corals there's probably i would say 30 heads there and it always started with 10 which is awesome uh somehow i used to have uh again aptasia came back but that's where i used to live now for that reason either the purple star polyps killed it or me throwing hot water on it killed it also so this is what the the colony of infernal mushroom corals started i got I think there is one or two heads there and now up here there is a whole family so I'm not 100% worried I think it will kill off the amphilia just like this green hairy mushroom coral has killed off the amphilia that I was trying to grow with it uh, still do not know what's the wrong with this it's supposed to be a elephant ear mushroom coral and yeah they my fish are always hungry I just fed them and they Still want to eat. They're mature clowns. The blue damsel doing good. Uh, green star polyps are doing good. They're growing, but they're not overtaking the tank. This is the yellow tail damsel doing great. I got a few red mushroom corals growing back here or there. Uh, not too many. They just grow randomly. They're not really too strong of the growers. But yeah, these protopales are doing great as well. These rastas, let's get that color focused, are just doing beautiful. A lot a lot of heads and these utter chaos are doing great especially down there they're just doing great um yeah so this is the take so far overall for 2020 and these are green cabbage leather corals they're just overpopulating the tank slowly keep splitting off and growing heads um what i do want to what i do want to show you guys is that this thing is really weird. Uh, this is the toadstool leather coral, and no matter what position or angle the rock, it still bends over, and it's growing, like you can see right here. It's growing, but it just, for no reason, it just angles like that itself, and doing fine so far, it's growing. It used to be smaller. Um, same thing with this. This is another toadstool mushroom coral hiding back there. I would flip it over, and it would just hide between the corals. I don't know why it's doing that, no matter where no matter how I flip it over, it does that. So yeah, this is my tank so far. Yeah, where's that Azura Damsel? He's hiding right back there. He's doing well. They all my fish doing well. Uh, probably not gonna be buying any livestock for a while. So far, I'm enjoying this tank the way it is. Really do miss the youth, uh, me being focused on fish tank, but at that rate, my uh, subscribers, it's very hard to be very successful in fish tanks and subscribers, like subscriber wise. So it's, it's a small audience, so I moved to the automotive, which I'm more successful at. But yeah, this is my sump. Looking good so far. I wish I was able to put the sump somehow behind the tank or underneath, but with my setup, it's, I would need special stands and everything, so that's the way I just decided to go with. Uh, yeah, this is my take so far. A beautiful looking take. And I'm Eddie V, and I'll see you guys next time.